What's up guys, Coach Bobby back here again. You've heard me say the, 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 the adage, the mantra about having your bags packed, right? And I always say that when the opportunity knocks, knock, knock, knock on your door, have your bags packed and ready to go. And so along the way, you have to be ready and packing those bags so when the chance to succeed, the chance to, 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 to make a point, the chance to be great, you're ready for it. And it ain't always about the, the, the grandiose, the great big things we think about, right? The winning touchdown, the board meeting, uh, uh, the date, the beach. It's about small things too, right? Small things too along the way that if you weren't ready for, right, by packing your bags, you missed that moment. I'm gonna give you an example, right? So I was in the mall this last weekend with my family. We're walking around the mall, right? And, and I can't help but notice that people are looking at me, right? I just walked out boot camp, I'm walking, and we do a game, we do a game while I walk ahead of my son. My son is half Salvadorian, half black, so you can't really tell he's half black because he has straight hair. So if I walk far enough ahead of him, you can't tell he's my son. Right? So we play a game. I walk ahead of him. I'm in my tank top. I'm walking through the mall. And he counts how many guys pass me and look back at my arms. Right? I know it's a dumb game, but we count them. I think it was 17 last time we counted. So that's, that's dumb, right? But it feels good to me. It feels good to me. So, and I only do that once in a while. So, once in a while. So, if I ain't ready, if my bags aren't packed, I can't enjoy that moment. Right? I can't enjoy the fact that I can walk, it's like going to the beach, right? Going to the beach, going to Hawaii. You can't decide the day of Hawaii or the week of Hawaii to pack your bags. It's too late. Have them packed, right? Or oh, you missed that moment. Knock, 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 Hawaii's here. Bags aren't packed. Oh, well, I'll see you in two years on your next trip. So the backpacking is a, is a cool phrase, but it's real. It's real. Uh, 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 scenario number two, right? My daughter comes to my, to my wife and I talking about, talking about sex ed. She's 14, right? Going through sex ed class, right? I've been talking on videos. I've been, I've, been, I've been talking in here. I've been building confidence for the last few years. Now, when she does that, she surprised us. She does that while well, I'm ready. My bags are packed. I'm ready to sit down and have an adult to young adult conversation with my child, right, about sex. Right? If I wasn't ready, that moment could be lost forever. Right? That, the, the impact we had as, as a couple, my wife and I, because we were ready, is gonna, is gonna, is gonna generate uh, so, much, so much goodwill, so much communication between my daughter and us that you can't put a price on that. But had my bags not been packed, had I not been prepared for that, had I stumbled my words, or acted shy, or acted embarrassed, I might lose my daughter forever. Or for at least a long time to some dude, right, that tells her some corny story about how he loves her, all right? Last scenario, right? So then yesterday, fast forward a few more days, I'm going to my daughter's school, right? Rushing there to pay for some payment for her, for a cheerleading uh, uh, payment, right? For a cheer, cheer and dance, sorry, cheer and dance, right? So I get there, coming from boot camp class, right? So I'm still swole, I just worked out, got my tape on my wrist, I'm walking through the school. I, I, I have not been to her school one time. Right, as far as during school session, as far as right after I worked out. So I'm walking through the campus, right, fully lotioned, right, fully swole with my daughter, right? Bags is packed, right? Bags is packed, opportunity to show all these fools at the school, that's my daughter, right? It's, again, it might, it might be small, right? But that, that might be the nugget that prevents some dude, some young boy from talking to my daughter the wrong way, right? That might be one, one small nugget that gives her the confidence to walk to the school knowing that this is her daddy, right? So, so we don't know, again, the, the big ones are nice. Preparing for the big opportunities are easy, right? But it's the small ones too. So every day we go through life, right? We're preparing for something. We're packing bags for something. And so I ask you to embrace all of it. All of it, all the hardship, all the pain, all the discomfort, and embrace it as, as opportunities to pack your bags and get ready for something coming, right? A game winning free throw, a, a winning touchdown, a day on the beach, all those are obvious, but the small ones too. Walking through the mall and having somebody look at you, right? Asking somebody where you go work out at, those things matter, 
Right, one of my boot campers told me a story about how for the first time in her group of friends, they asked her to do stuff with the kids because they saw her as the fittest in the group. And she told me she had never before been considered the fittest in her group. That's small to us, but to her it was huge, right? So when opportunity came, her bags were packed, right? When opportunity came, her bags were packed. So every day you walk through life, guys, when it gets hard, when it gets tedious, when it gets frustrating, just imagine, Coach Bobby says, I'm packing my bags and I'm getting ready for an opportunity because it's coming and when it comes, my bags will be packed.